Hey, what's up, sports bettors? It's Matt Modi with Dodge Jam. In this video, I'm going to be giving out a sharp player prop bet for Thursday night football tomorrow. So we got the game that you see on the screen here, Colts versus Broncos. Now, there's actually, unsurprisingly, because it's the NFL and because it's Thursday, a ton of injury news specifically for this game. You can see some of it on the screen here now, right? Russell Wilson expects to play Thursday night against the Indianapolis Colts. He is nursing a right shoulder injury. He says that he's going to play. I trust that he's going to play. It's hard to say how limited he will be from that shoulder injury. I am going into it assuming that he will be fine because there's nothing else to assume, but we'll just have to monitor as the days go on. The next big injury news is Jonathan Taylor. He hurt his ankle last week uh, against the Titans. He has said that he is going to play. Uh, the team has made it seem like it's a little more questionable. With an ankle injury on a short week for a running back, I would guess even if he plays that he will be limited. And then, of course, there is the Javante Williams injury. Now we know he's not playing. What we don't know is how they are going to mix up the running back snaps. Uh, they just signed Latavius Murray. They have Mike Boone that has been there as well. And then, of course, they have Melvin Gordon, who can't stop fumbling. So tons of injury news. And for that reason... Not a lot of books have posted player props yet. So as the day goes on today, I'm recording this on Wednesday. I'm assuming by the end of today, 100% by tomorrow, all the books will have their player props posted. As of right now, we're working with a little bit of a limited option, but I did find one that I really liked. So I want to go ahead and lock it in and talk to you about it. The play is Russell Wilson over one and a half passing touchdowns. I'm going to put a half unit on it. And here we see it. This is a positive expected value play that I found using Odds Jam. The reason why I was able to find this play is just because I'm signed up for every book that is available in my state. So for you, whatever state you're in, I would just see what the betting landscape is, what the books are in your state. See if there's one that you are not signed up with and either sign up using the links in the description of the video or you can go to oddsjam.com and, and sign up using the link from the website here as well. Regardless, promo hopping, using the promo promotion bonuses, signing up for all the sports books is incredibly important to being profitable in the long run. So I cannot stress this enough. Be signed up for all those books. So the play here, Russell Wilson over one and a half passing touchdowns. So he um, has hit this in only one of the games that he has played in so far with the Broncos. It's been a rough start for this Broncos offense. Maybe they seemed to figure some stuff out last game. They scored the most points that they've scored, 23. Uh, they finally had a good offensive game. Of course, they lost because their defense couldn't stop Josh Jacobs and the Raiders, but at least their offense has something to work off of. They're playing a Colts team that has the worst offense in the entire NFL, according to DVOA, and a middle-of-the-pack defense, I think like 16, 14, something like that. Not horrible, not good either. So they should be able to move the ball. Um, my guess is that they're probably going to be using Mike Boone a lot because he is their receiving back, even though he had some horrible drops last game. He still is their receiving back. Melvin Gordon is an okay receiver, kind of limited. Latavius Murray isn't really a receiver at all. But the passing touchdowns over one and a half for Russell Wilson, I really like. So it's a positive expected value play, right? Of course, I found using Ajdan. The no big line prices this at about plus 125. And the cool thing about Ajdam is just all of the different features and the functionality you have in terms of filtering. Like I knew I wanted to bet on NFL player props, so I filtered NFL. I filtered specifically for player props. And here we have it. Like I said, not all the books have posted their player props yet, which is why we see only one here, but it's still a really good one. So I went ahead and locked it in. Uh, the play, again, Russell Wilson over one and a half passing touchdowns. I locked it in at plus 129 on play up as you saw right here. And let's chat about the math behind this one. I talked about the game a little bit. So the no big line, which I mentioned, this is calculated from Odds Jam uh, from a basically just thousands and thousands of bets being back tested, just a ton of data being collected to determine what are the sharp books in terms of pricing odds, which books, as my dog wants to say hi, do the best job at pricing odds. And once that determination has been made, they'll just remove the VIG from a weighted average from all of those sharp books. So um, what we see here, looking at all of the books, Pinnacle, sharpest sports book in the world, Bet Online, 
another sharp one, prices this pretty decently below the plus 129 on PlayUp, plus 102, plus 115 on DraftKings and Tipico, bet, bet online at plus 110, all pricing it pretty decently below this line at plus 129 on PlayUp. So this is going to be my early player prop. Once more odds get posted, I will have more. So stick tuned on this channel. Subscribe to the IJM YouTube channel. Now let me just add this one to my bet tracker, and that is going to be it. So I appreciate you guys watching, and have a good one.